Hey folks, this is Adria. How are you? I made another video called how to convert iPhone voice memos to MP3 and I keep getting a lot of questions from people who are saying, Adria, when I click on my, uh, you know, item to convert, like let's look at here, we have uh, old people driving. People are saying, I don't see the MP3 option at all. I don't see it. It's just completely missing. So this video is to show you how to, uh, in iTunes, set up the MP3 conversion. Um, in this case, old people driving, right, uh, is a thought that I shared and why I think it's dangerous sometimes for old people to drive because I saw this old person almost run over someone, right? Anyway, um, I recorded this on my iPhone. It was my 3GS. We can see here that it's an M4A file, you know, but I want this as an MP3. So then I can bring it into Audacity and edit it, right? But when I want to convert it, ops, you know, there's no option. What's going on? I'll show you. So what you have to do is you have to go over to your preferences and you have to change your import options. They need to be for import as MP3. So on the first tab known as general, you'll go down here to where it says when you insert a CD, import settings. I know that's not very clear. You wouldn't really think that for converting music, uh, audio files that are, were not from a CD, but here's where it's at. So import using mp3 encoder boom now i'm gonna hit okay and i'm gonna hit okay again now if i want to convert old people driving all i do is i right click and there we go create mp3 version that's also available up here in the advanced menu and then i go ahead and hit it and wow it was that fast because it was only 50 seconds long of my thoughts so um that is how you make the option create mp3 version available in itunes enjoy